All right, welcome back to Two Douchey Guys for yet another beer review. And yet again, there's one douche. Uh, the other one's busy again. Uh, we're going to start getting some more uh, reviews online. We're going to do a little trip, try to collect some stuff that we can't get locally. Um, today, if you, some of you probably already noticed, the swirly top, and we're talking about Three Floyd's Brewery today. We're going to review... Zombie Dust. Now, Zombie Dust is one of my all-time favorites. I'll say that up front, but we're going to go ahead and we're going to check it out. So, this is just the 12 ounce, so we'll get it checked out. So, ah, uh, yeah, yeah, love that. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we don't want to show that, do we? <laughs> so you can tell by the, the color. It's real clear. It's got a real good thick head on it. The smell is just real, real citrusy. Grapefruity. You can get some underlying malt. Uh, it's a real good balance. I mean, this is, like I said, this is a really good beer. Um, it's uh, Three Floyds Brewing out of uh, Munster, Indiana. Uh, it's an American Pale Ale, 6.2% 6 ABV. Now, they say it's year-round, but i got to tell you, it's difficult to come by at times. Ah, man, that just smells so good. All right, let's give it a taste. Again, real hoppy. It's got a real nice uh, balance, though, on the malt. Uh, it's got that malt sweetness on the back. And then it just cuts, gets cut through by the uh, the hop. Again, it's real hoppy, um, but it's not overly acidic or anything. It's a real balance. It's just a nice bitterness to it. It's definitely one of my favorites. I would say for the style, American Pale Ale, I would put this at a probably a 10 out of 10. I would say this is just a prime example of an American Pale Ale. Um, overall, rating against other beers I've had, I would say this is I'd say it's a 9 or 10. I mean, it's up there. It's one of those, I'm going to go out of my way, and I'm going to get it, and I'm going to enjoy it. Um, I'll go give it a 9 right now. Um, I've got another trip planned later in the summer. I hope to come across some Hetty Topper or something from out east. I'm um, going west this time, so hopefully I'll have some other good examples to compare to this, but this is definitely a a great beer if you uh, never had it if you've never had zombie dust uh, work your tail off come out here to Indiana go up to uh, Munster it's just outside of Chicago so you know take a trip to Chicago come on over to Indiana pick up some zombie dust try it out uh, you're not gonna be disappointed it's just such a great smell real smooth good tasting See that head still hanging on there? See, it's got some good lacing. It's it's a good, good beer. Check it out. You'll enjoy it. 
And uh, as always, it's 2DG. Watch for more. There's more coming soon. We're going to make our trip west, try to pick up some beers. Uh, we're not going all the way to the coast, though, so you know we're going to miss out on some good ones. But I'm hoping to pick up some other stuff along the way and back that we can't get here. And then later in the summer, I'm going east all the way to the coast. And I hope to get some really good stuff to also show here. So we'll be reviewing whatever we bring back. So uh, be sure to uh, like the video, subscribe, and go ahead and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about zombie dust. Personally, it's one of my favorites. Tell me what you think about it. 2DG.